This video provides a high-level overview of the ESXi firewall and how you can use it to best protect the ESXi hosts in your environment. The ESXi management interface is protected by a firewall that is enabled by default. At installation time, the firewall is configured to block incoming and outgoing traffic, except traffic for certain default services, such as DNS and DHCP. Rule set configuration files are in the Etsy VMware firewall directory. Rule set configuration files contain firewall rules for each service and describe the rules relationship with ports and protocols. Service.xml contains the predefined firewall rules that can be enabled or disabled for the ESXi host from the vSphere client. If you need to enable the service on a protocol that is not defined, create new firewall rules by editing the service.xml file from the command line. You can add services to the ESXi firewall by creating and installing a vib package that contains a rule set configuration file for the service. For example, the port rules for the vSphere high availability agent are described in fdm.xml. You can use the vSphere client to manage the ESXi firewall. For example, you can view firewall settings on the host security profile, allow access to services, and add allowed IP addresses. To configure incoming and outgoing firewall connections for a service or a management agent, browse to the host in the inventory. Click Configure and under System, click Firewall. Services in the ESXi firewall are displayed. Each rule is listed including the incoming and outgoing port numbers and the port type. You can enable the rule set for a service and open its associated firewall ports by clicking Edit, then selecting the checkbox for the service in the Edit Security Profile dialog and clicking OK. For example, here we enable the rule set for Active Directory All. When a rule set is enabled, you allow remote clients to access that service. For some services, you can manage service details by navigating to Services. You can start a service, you can stop a service, and you can restart a service by clicking the appropriate icon. When a service starts, its rule set is enabled. When a service is stopped, the rule set is disabled. Required services cannot be disabled. You can automate when a service is enabled or disabled by selecting the service, then clicking Edit Startup Policy. For example, here we change the policy to start and stop with port usage. The Startup Policy column is updated to reflect the policy you selected. To add allowed IP addresses, select the host, click Configure, and navigate to Firewall. Click Edit and select a service. Deselect Allow Connections from any IP address. Enter the allowed IP addresses. You can enter individual IP addresses, separated by commas, or a range of addresses. You can enter IPv4 or IPv6 addresses. Click OK. The allowed IP addresses column is updated with the new addresses. For more information about managing the ESXi firewall, see the vSphere Security Guide at docs.vmware.com.